Hey there guys, so today we have another review and this is Other Half's DDH Double Dry Hopped Mylar Bags. Uh, thanks Will. Uh, 8.5% uh, canned last week. Last week, yeah. Yeah. And, um, oh sorry, you see that Mylar bag kind of... The label speaks for itself. <laughs> yeah, there you, you go. Know, it's very uh, expressive. Beer comes in a deep gold to pale amber color, really hazy. A little murky, yeah. Yeah, very murky. Let's get Roma. Ooh, straight diesel. It's got that diesel mixed with tropical fruits. A lot of, it's, it's, it's extra, sorry, uh, quite fruity. Very fruity. Um, passion fruit mango kind of thing. Yeah, I mean, especially after the last beer, it, a lot of papaya, a lot of passion fruit. Yeah, it smells uh, very tropical, but it has that kind of intensity kind of burn of like hop burn that sometimes yes. you get from the other half beers. So let's see, I mean, when I had this on the day it released, I thought it was awesome. It's about a week old, so it's mellowed probably a little bit. Yeah, there's a really nice depth. Yeah, so. see how Cheers. it is. Cheers, dude. Mmm. Very creamy. Mm hmm Very nice. Um, wow. This works for me. This works for me. It's great. Yeah. But it does have a little bit of burn to it. That extra dry hopping that they do, I guess, really is punching through, but... Yeah. Uh, initial impressions is that it... I've had previous batches of regular mm -hmm. Mylar, and that one for me sold a lot more intensity of the kind of a burn and diesel and the dank that other half has. This one leans a little bit more towards the soft side with that, mm -hmm. still that in the back. It's a little cold still, but maybe at this ABV, it's we're drinking at the right temperature. 8.5. That is beautifully um, juicy and soft up front. There's tons of sweet mango, passion from driving for days. Maybe even a little bit of stone fruit, mm -hmm. sweet peachiness. Um, it's an awesome beer. That means yeah, we just straight like crushing mango mm -hmm. passion fruit, just really beautiful tropical fruit up front for me. We, we were talking a little bit earlier that they've picked up the pace in their releases. Like it used to be every other weekend, and now it's like two cans a week, three cans mm -hmm. a week, but. These last few weeks of releases have just been really, really good, and it's really nice to soft this one for other yeah. for me as well, despite that finish. And as I wait a little bit more, we're getting more of this kind of like maybe sweet melon note and get some cantaloupe driving through as well. Um, but then there is that kind of dank drying to it, which I like the balance mm. on this one. It's delicious. It does have a little nice green bitterness that rips through. Yeah, there's a green flavor that actually lingers throughout the palate, mm -hmm. but uh, in general. It tastes very soft and um, it's an awesome beer. Yeah, it really is good. Um, you first this time. But you sort of get that finish on, uh, that I'm talking about, but it's not necessarily too bitter, but a little bit of that kind of like other half, like dank kind of drying. Yeah. Kind of yeah. Um, yeah. Really nice. I'm a big fan of this one. Um, easily one of the better other half beers I've had recently. Awesome. Um, that's her rating. It's so creamy, right? Big fan. Let's go with the 99. I'm loving wow, this beer. 99. Uh, we've had a few beers in between. That Cellar Maker yeah. was the first beer we had. And to come back to this one is sort of where I put it. So. It's not quite the same level as the Cellar Maker for me. Sure. This may be a 96, 97 just because, you know, I, I love other half, but I wish they would change up that yeast every once in a while or do something to get rid of that kind of diesel-y, chemical-y flavor that sometimes lingers in the end. I, I see what you're talking about. But as far as that juiciness, I, I do love it. It's I've had two or three different releases of Mylar bags prior to this, and this is certainly the best one. And just yeah. They're just getting better and better, which is pretty amazing, I guess. It's, I see what you're saying, and I certainly can see that there's benefits to the Cellar Maker beer, the uh, juice gymnastics. Yeah. This one for the creaminess and that intensity mm -hmm. of fruit. Of it is really it is quite different. Body, yeah. Just full awesome body. Beer. So really nice stuff. So until next time, guys. Cheers. Mm -hmm. Let us know what you think about DDH Mylar bags. Later.